you know, wrestling fans, I just want you to know, I don't care if it was CM Punk's first Royal Rumbles, uh, Royal Rumble uh, match in 10 years. I don't care. I don't care if it was a, a, a pay-per-view where Naomi came back. I don't care. I don't care if it was a pay-per-view where we saw Roman Reigns once again, once again, retain the undisputed WWE Championship in which we all knew he was going to, and we all know, we all know that he is well on his way, well on his way, in my eyes, to breaking every single person's record in WWE except Bruno San Martino. I do not think he's going to break his record. I don't care. The fact of the matter is this. Last night's Royal Rumble, in my estimation, is one of the most lackluster Royal Rumbles in recent history. By far, one of the most lackluster pay-per-views in recent history as far as the Royal Rumble. By far. <clears throat> I mean the crowd in the opening contest wasn't even getting into it for the majority of it. They sat on their hands. Sat on their hands. It was, it was very lackluster. Some might say, well, what, what are you complaining about, Webby? Cody Rose has a chance to finish his story. whoop de do. I'm going to tell you, I hope, I hope The Rock does not get a title shot next month. I'm hoping that does not happen. Here's what I hope happens. That night one, we see the rock, or excuse me, night one, we see Cody Rhodes versus Roman Reigns. And night two, we see the rock versus Roman Reigns. That's what I hope we see at WrestleMania. For WrestleMania 40. As far as Seth Rollins and the WWE uh, world title is concerned, listen, we all know that it's going to be CM Punk, and we all know that CM Punk is more than likely going to take that title off of uh, Seth Rollins at WrestleMania. Look, <clears throat> That's just going to have to take a back seat. Uh, it, it'll have to take a back seat in, in my eyes. Quite frankly, I think it would have been a much better card if uh, uh, Gunther um, would have won the Royal Rumble and we got Gunther versus Seth Rollins and we got uh, CM Punk versus Cody Rhodes and we would have had The Rock versus Roman Reigns. Because we know the end result at WrestleMania, and that is Roman Reigns walking out, still the undisputed WWE champion. We would have had a good contest between CM Punk and Cody Rhodes, and we would have a new champion crowned in Gunther at WrestleMania, somebody that everybody universally likes. That, to me, would have been a much 
better, much better uh, uh, card for WrestleMania. Much better. Instead, we got what we got last night. Instead, we got what we got last night. Now, where's Brock Lesnar? Um, speaking of The Rock, where was The Rock last night? Uh, I mean, where, where was all these um, Royal Rumble surprises, okay? I mean, where were they? I mean, if Brock Lesnar is still under WWE, okay, and if he's going to be a part of WrestleMania, don't you think the Royal Rumble would be a good place to start setting up for his WrestleMania match? And as far as The Rock is concerned, don't you think that... Um, the Royal Rumble would have been a good place uh, for at least him to uh, stare down um, Roman Reigns. And yes, I do understand that Cody Rhodes practically stared down, practically told his answer last night at the Royal Rumble when he stared down Roman Reigns. Make this is this is ridiculous to me, absolutely ridiculous to me. It is formulaic WWE typical one oh one what they did last night. Now Did we uh, see a few comebacks? Yeah. It's nice to see Andrade back in the WWE. Don't get me wrong. I'm not going to sit here and complain about everything. I'm not going to sit here and complain about every single thing that went on last night. Andrade, Andrade back in WWE, that's good. Naomi back in WWE, that's good. But overall, I just don't care about last night's Royal Rumble event. I just don't care. Y'all let me know what you're thinking in the comments below. Subscribe to the channel today. Hit that bell button. Go back and check out anything you missed. Any backyard beat down content uh, on the channel, go back and check it out. Any other uh, content on the channel, go check that out as well. Guys, as far as backyard beat down is concerned, season five, season five starts in March. So look forward to that. And let me know what you're thinking about last night's Royal Rumble event. To me, overall, it was crap. Anyway, <laughs> I'll talk to you later. <laughs> oh, let me know what you're thinking and I'll catch you off on the other side. Talk to you later.